Are you gonna be able to see me with the sun back there? I, I don't care, I gotta get this going. Uh, Monday morning, it's going to be a scorcher out today. Uh, I thought I saw in the news that this is the first time in April that we've had back-to-back -back days in the 80s here in the Seattle area. Hope we take advantage of this nice day. The other thing, which is a weird thing that I'm interested in, this is a new home for us. Our other home stayed fairly cool on the hot days. We don't have air conditioning here. Very few people in the, uh, the area have air conditioning because it doesn't get that hot for that long a period of time. Just doesn't make sense to have it. Um, I'm interested to see how cool our house stays or how warm our house gets. Um, since this is the first time we're really seeing it get to a, a significant temperature here. So a weird thing, but something I'm looking forward to seeing today. Okay, right there it's 76 already. Inside the house, it's 69 already. How do I turn on the TV? I'm going to record myself doing this so you can do it every time now. Just come back and watch this video. Or you could just tell me HDMI too. Yeah, but you, the way you do it, you gotta push input and then you push scroll up. Okay. Two things I want to chat with you about. Okay. Can you turn it down a little bit? Mm -hmm. Okay. Number one. This doesn't have to, none of this stuff has to be done today. Okay. But just this week. Number one. Mm -hmm. I'd like to have a business meeting with you. Okay. Number two. I'd like to have a date with you. Okay. And I'd like those two things to be separate from each other. Yeah, for sure. Morgan, I'd like a couple things to talk to you about. Okay? Hey. Yeah. Number one, I'd like to do a goal setting session with you, which does not include the amount of TV we watch, no. But maybe the lack of TV we watch. Let's limit the time of TV we watch. Number two, Morgan, I'd like to have a date with you. Okay, you in for that? 90 degrees. 73 degrees inside. Yeah, so what do you think about this temperature right here at the Marina Catherine? It's perfect. It's perfect. What would you say it is? 75? Maybe 75. Probably not even.
You know what that red building is down there? Yeah, that's Lombardi's. What's Lombardi's? That's an Italian restaurant where we had our rehearsal dinner. You wanna go there? You don't remember that place, Morgan. I don't think you've ever been there, Mo. I've never been there. <laughs> We're home from the marina. It was a, a roaring success, wouldn't you say, Catherine? Yeah. How was the marina today on a scale of one to 10? Probably a nine. Nine, nice, yeah. okay. The only thing that would have been better is if we could have like gone to one of the restaurants, sat down and enjoyed the view. But over here. She makes it a little complicated. Yeah, I, I like, temperature was perfect. Yeah, perfect. it was perfect. Now, back at the old homestead. Yep. So, I don't know if I stated this already, but the reason why we took a little break this afternoon and headed to the marina, one, it's cooler over there, two, we knew that we were going to be having a very late night um, on negotiating a couple of offers that we have going on on a listing side and a buyer side of things. And that, so we just knew we were going to be busy tonight, so we wanted to sneak in a little family time here in the middle of the day. Morgan? Morgan, what's up with your foot? What's up with your foot? Where's your sock? <coughs> Why do you always take one sock off? Temperature inside as of now is 73 degrees and outside temperature is 66 so temperature is dropping when I checked a little while ago the temperature was actually 74 so the temperature in the house is starting to drop also all in all I would say not bad for the temperature getting over 90 degrees we were very comfortable in here today. We'll see what it's like to sleep in here tonight, but I do think we need to get our ceiling fan installed very, very soon. Mm -hmm. 